What's up, guys? Keith from Sports Betting Across America. Dudes, that was a rough Saturday college football. Pretty much like nothing went the way we expected, and really what killed us more than anything was a couple key injuries. So it was just straight up a bloodbath. It's very rare when I don't hit at least a few slips, and that's kind of what happened today. And we're basically almost dead even now on the season. Kind of gave everything back yesterday. A lot of this today, okay? This play right here was three out of four, and this dude got hurt early in the third quarter. This would have been an absolute banger. And then the Cam Rising injury just absolutely crushed him, and then it crushed his tight end because the backup for Utah is actually Zach Wilson's little brother, and he might just be as bad as Big Brother. So it really sucked. I felt like uh, we would have had a chance with Cam Rising and uh, Kuthe, the tight end, if that didn't happen. And then this, you know, basically would have been, it would have looked like a whole different day if we could have just got two of these fucking slips to hit. That's usually what happens at the bare minimum. However, with all that said, we still have these plays open that are included in these units. And then we have these that are like pretty much just need a duo to hit, duo to hit. So this can really save us. And I told you guys I'm going to combine everything into uh, the first two weeks that concludes all the way till Monday Night Football, uh, Jets, Niners, right? We need these plays, guys. My VIPs need them. Most of my VIPs are still actually over on WAP because I moved everybody over there. And now I'm moving everybody back to winnable. And so most of the guys are still on WAP. A lot of them are people that got on at the very end of uh, the last season, NFL season, when I got really hot, uh, college and NFL. And they've been through this. They, we've had brutal weeks just like this before. You're going to have them. Uh, the goal is to try to only have one, two, or three out of like 20 weeks a year. So we got one out of the way. It's still not over, though. This, this will change everything. Even if like one of these plays hits, it'll stop a lot of damage. If, you know, we can get a couple of these and we have these, um, we have these ones all open as well. So we have a couple five, five pick bangers here for a grand each. So if the, if we get that perfect game, Rams lions, it could, it could just turn everything around real quick and we'll be up, you know, 30 units again, just like that, possibly more. So let's hope for some good fortunes there. Uh, if you're new here, definitely hit sub to the channel. We got some nice, steady, organic growth going on here, guys. I do appreciate it. Check out this NFL video right here. Um, I got a free pick. It's uh, in the Bills and Arizona game. And then I kind of break down the whole slates, uh, kind of what I'm thinking, some key spots. NFL ones can be very tricky. So I'm kind of more in like observe mode this week. We're going to be pretty light on the VIP. I do have a couple free plays. I even really, in the NFL, up until we really get some data, I actually like to lower my unit size. I like to chop it in half a lot of times. College, I go balls to the wall because I've just seen it too many times. Today, it's just all the games we thought were going to pop off. None of them did. Um, the least likely spots, you know, uh, were the ones that hit today. And then really, we had a bunch of duos that hit. I just didn't combo them correctly. So it's going to happen. But NFL, we're going to take a wait and see approach. We're going to go a little lighter, maybe chop the units in half. Okay, guys, so I do have a free pick in this video. It's going to be around that game, that Sunday night football game, and it's going to be one of the boom plays that I already have open right here. You guys might actually even get better lines on this because I set this actually last week, um, specifically like you know for this game. So what we're going to do is like what we did in this Bills game. We're going to build a little boom <coughs> league industry um, leading payout for three mans. And it's this one right here. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to pretend that the Lions, they are favored in this game. And Jameer Gibbs have a good day running the ball. And then we're going to stack Stafford and Nakua to just bring it back. You know, a little, a little. it's like writing a script right here, right? So I think more often in, than not in the NFL, one side will go over more often than not. And one side will go under. So, you know, I do love Goff and Brown when they're at home. It's usually a great bet. And... Last year in the wild card game, everyone went over just barely. Um, I golf barely went over. Stafford went over by a lot, <clears throat> but I like this spot. Um, I think Gibbs is one of the you know better young running backs in the league. The only thing that could fuck us here is if he like had a really good day receiving. So I wouldn't hate the combo yards here either. Um, but hopefully he just breaks a long runoff and he's consistent and they don't give Montgomery 
uh, too much work. This is the explosive back, so I would like to take his over rushing yards more often than not versus somebody like Montgomery, who's just kind of a plotter, you know. This guy's the one that will break off the 20-yard runs. So that's going to be our free pick in the Sunday night football game. Um, I would definitely – it's hard, man. It's hard to say. I think the Lions are just the superior team this year, um, both sides of the ball. Uh, I think they've improved up front. I think their secondary is still pretty young, can be exposed, but we'll see. And there, there's just no uh, there's no comparisons on the offensive line. This is The Lions probably have arguably the best O-line in football. They I think they believe PFF graded them out number one. So lock this play in. And I'm going to make a couple more videos for you guys right now, actually, just giving you a free play in a couple other key games. Not all the games, but a couple of the key games. So uh, make sure you sub to the channel, guys. I do appreciate the support. Let's fucking save the week. Come on, Rams, Lions. We need y'all.